Warning, if you are offended by a poorly imitated uh, Russian accent, you should really turn off this video now. You have been warned and it is incoming. Good luck. Hello and welcome back to World of Tanks. I got another little treat for you here in the, uh, well, in the Russian heavy tank DKV2. And uh, yeah. The reason why I'm standing still here is because I was looking at this percentage chance to win and since I'm driving the KV2 and it is top tier I wanted to like uh, have a early recording on it but I had because I had problems with my replays it is fixed now and the way to fix it was to um what is it called to remove all my mods so yeah we are modless but this I can tell this mod this is a 33 percenter Literally, uh, itchy, so itchy. Literally, almost every tank on my team was below 700 W8. If you wanna, if you wanna compare it to that. So, I knew I had to carry a lot because the enemy team had a couple of really good players and, of course, some worse. But yeah, we're driving the KV2, and, and KV2 does not care about matchmaking. KV2 kick ass anyway. As long as there is target in front of KV2, KV2 is happy. Drive, and of course I'm driving with a 152mm, because is there really any, any other gun in the KV2? No, there's not. There's not. And of course you will you will see the inf infamous KV2 accuracy within this replay. A couple times, really. Because KV2 does not need to aim when shoot. Remember, if, dry, if gunner and gun is knocked out, KV2 has best accuracy in game. Best, best Russian accent ever. I'll stop now, I'll stop now. <laughs> I'm sorry. If I offended anyone, I'm sorry. But yeah, we're moving slowly up towards the Skoda T24 and the Stug. Oh, hello! It's me! And he's dead. Gotcha! Alright, I'm pulling back. The Jack Pencil just shot. I'm halfway reloaded, so I'm just gonna move forward. There's a Scott T25 above me, but he can't see me. And there's that OI experimental that is eh, kind of cheeky. But no matter, I reloaded, and you're dead! Of course, that. Even though that was like a. No, no aiming required there. And all that, he could still have missed, of course, but it eh, didn't happen. But that's not the one. The one we will see very soon. Can, oh, is that you'll see? Oh, what's that? Gunner, you feel something? You, you, you feel you feel tension in your finger? You just have to shoot? Okay, fire! There you go! Came into power! Doesn't even need to aim. Oh, what's that? VK? Okay, he's a little bit further away, Gunner. So why about you aim this one a little bit at least? Alright, let's aim this one through. There we go. KV2 still hits though. So four kills. Looking uh, average. <laughs> if you wanna call it that. Oh, look at that Skoda. Oh, the, oh, the VK. Hmm, he's on quite low HP. Hmm. Auto aim increases accuracy. Indeed it does. Russian KV2. Damn, I did it again. I'm sorry. So I have one shot everything I've been shooting at so far. Funny. Oh T. Oh Type T34. Snack. Maybe the Skoda. He has a lot of HP though. Would be a shame if somebody took it. He bounced. No, I did not one shot him. What a shame. Oh, that's that's a big hit. That's a that's a gorilla. That shot me. VK is moving forward here to try to secure the kill. But it looks like he is failing drastic. Oh, he's gonna get him. Is he gonna get him? Is he gonna get him? No, he didn't. Alright. It's looking well a, a little bit worse, not rock really bad, but a little bit worse. So oh there's the type back. He is down to 5 HP. And, uh, well, if it's stupid but it works, it ain't stupid. Still hits though, because Russian, I guess. 
might be. Uh, I'm, I'm joking. I'm making uh, jokes about KV, KV2 jokes here. That's just me. Well, we get a bit cautious up here. Don't know where th that artillery is aiming. So it's actually looking okay now. <laughs> I'm sitting with six kills and all that. Come on, nope. No shot at the Crusader there. Uh, so I I could have taken it, but it was a bit risky. The Chris, no, not the Crusader, but the Gorilla misses me. Barely. Alright, it's time to try to help out the team. And yeah. Hmm. There's the enemy KV2. A rival KV2, and he has more HP than me. That's not good. Auto aim. Come on. Ah, the T67 got him. Ah, I get spot. I get spotted. I know there is tanks to my left, so I pull back. Don't want to get shot by any of them. And gonna take it a little bit cautious here. We lost another tank to the Sherman 3. And we are going to lose Matilda 4 as well, I think. Come on, let's get that spot up. Let's get the spots. Oh, KV2 is moving backwards. Ah, I get spotted again. I don't know really what is spotting me right now. It might be the Crusader, but I don't think it was. I think it was a bit too far away. It might be in the Sherman or the T-34, 85. But I'm not sure. And we lose our Matilda 4. Oh, oh, I'm sliding, sliding. Careful now. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, fine. Just a track. That's just a track. Hmm. That's uh. Nope, oh, nope. Oh, now there's one tank. Damn it, there were two. I need. You need to feed the Russian war machine. God, I did it again. And reverse while shooting. Not a problem for KV2. Not a problem. And of course the KV-2's reload is quite long, and so does the T-34-85 know that the reload is quite long. But the problem for him is, it's just not long enough. As you will see, right here. Auto aim increases accuracy, as we all know. Alright, rival KV-2 here. He is on a lot of HP. So in a 1v1 match, I might lose against him. And the KV-85 and the Crusader is nowhere to be found. There are only 2 minutes left of this match, well, 2 220. But this is Assault, and we are the defending team. Which fits me perfectly, so I reload AP. Which is like the premium, premium ammo, ammo uh, AP. Not premium, of course, but you know, the one that is more expensive. Because I pay with credit. But I get spotted by him. So he knows that I'm coming. But that doesn't really matter. I've AP loaded now. Now it's just a matter of aiming at the right spot. Right. Alright, the easy 8 here. He is trying to get a flanking shot on the KV2. He is in the proxy range. Come on, come on. I told him to stay back there, but uh, he got taken out by the gorilla. The gorilla's had a good game. And then, hello! Eight kills. So yeah, I see there is only one minute left. I pretty much can't kill three people. Well, find the 85, find the crusader, and then find the artillery in one minute. Well, it will take me one minute to just reload for each time. So yeah, this game is over, right? So I choose literally just to stay here and try to camp the match out. Wanna try to wanna try to get some spots off here in case some of them are close to me, then I can secure the game with with, with another shot in. 30 seconds left, and we are gonna speed up the replay by 4. We are the last one alive, 8 kills, there are 3 left, and uh, 5 seconds left, GG, question mark. 
Nice view. Bravo Blue. The artillery says, Why, thank you. So I'll put up one game stats and I'll see you in a second. Here we are at the post game stats. Uh, no surprise victory because uh, the assault mode. And it was an ace tanker, bruiser, fire effect, red level alter, high caliber, and a top gun. So, uh, post game, uh, well, the team score, sorry. As you can see, I was the only one that did over a thousand damage. Not that I have that much to say, but yeah. Also a 1442 XP, which is not bad at all. And on this other board, we shot 11 shots, where 10 hit and 10 penetrated. Well, of course, it might not have penetrated with HE, but... Um, you know, we hit and did a lot of damage to pretty much everyone. I guess the only one we actually did know it, it did not one-shot two, which were T-34 and the Skoda T-25. And we missed a shot. Missed a shot? Where was that? I can't remember. I always forget to like stuff like that, but yeah, and then we did 3000 damage, uh, where 279 was over 300 meters, which were probably were, no, that was not the ELC, uh, don't know again, hit received 4, where 2 of them penetrated and 2 of them bounced off, and blocked by armor was 220, which were the Skoda, I think, I think the Skoda hit me twice and bounced, I spotted 1, I damaged 9, and destroyed 8 of them, so there were 1 guy I didn't kill. <laughs> And 277 in the spotting or assistant damage. It was an exact 10 minute game because the timer went out. I still made a profit of 32,000 and an XP of on the triple, it was triple by then, on 6,489. So, not a bad game in the good old KV2 with this uh, Russian power. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching and don't forget that if you want to see your, your replays on my channel that I talk over, stuff like that. Don't forget, you can send it in, you can leave a link to either Wood Replace or QB Quick Babies Replay site in the comment section below, and I'll check them out, and I'll probably post them up here. So, away from that, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later.